you should not be isolating yourself because with the new technologies with what medical uh, you know uh, uh, medical treatment which is available right now cancer is not a terminal it has been proven I mean you have to be very open there's always reason for everything but sometimes because we are just a, the reasons may come in a big part of your life and uh, you have to be very very strong and, uh, and have a strong mind be open about it accept it and uh, once you start learning how to accept fight it at the same time keep your network support very very strong if you are married keep your family intact if you have only parents your dad and mom make sure you are always with them and also be good with your friends because these are the people who give you support the network support which is very key and if you keep a happy state of mind that will be the first step to get cured On advice on breaking the news to children, it depends on the age of the children. I think children are very much, you need to understand them. You need to make them understand what cancer is all about. What is the implication of having cancer and uh, what what they should do and what the fathers or parents should do. And uh, what I advise is, have a good environment, not in hospital, that's for sure. I mean, uh, break it to them and tell them that uh, you are suffering a terminally ill disease and what's the outcome and uh, but at the same time do tell them that you're fighting it this is something that you will win the battle and and uh, you will there for them i think children are very much important so that's where do not show any any at any point of time any and uh, sadness or you know feelings that you will lose the battle.